TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN headline news update. Hello, one Monday, March the 14th, Basil Chapman giving you the Tiger Financial News Network. 10 a.m. market update, Dow's up 183. You know, when these rumors come out, like on Friday, you just can't trust them. You've got to be wary because they're, they're just rumors. So there was another rumor, so, you know, just anything that has to do with moderating uh, the war that's going on in Ukraine, it really helps the market just momentarily and then reality sets in. So we're up 184, 33,128. Under any other circumstance, we should be seeing a terrific bounce. The Dow should be in the 34,300s instead of in the 33,100s. Not good. The S&P at this particular point also attempting a rally. Uh, the S&P is up 7 at 42.11. It really needs to get it. Wow, by Wednesday or Thursday, it needs to be up in the 4280, 4310 area to say, hey, I, I, I have some substance here. Don't rule me out. The QQQ index 100 trading down $1.19 at 323.24. Not good at all. It's got the lowercase H pattern that's going to a lowercase M. There's a little trend line support. Better hold three, uh, 322 today. Otherwise, it's a big problem. IWM. IWM is the Russell 2000 going from the lowercase H pattern to a lowercase M. So it doesn't, it's not doing anything right now. It's down 92 at 195 80 feet, but it just can't get out of its own way. It's showing residual strength, but not enough to break to the upside, just to hold support. Looking at gold, gold had a very sharp pullback um, starting from uh, about a week ago. Uh, it hit the two, 2007, uh, 2078 level. It's trading right now at 1959. I uh, made that peak E we were talking about, and we are looking at some kind of a digestive formation here in gold. And uh, look at the and silver's the same thing. Silver's pulling back. What is interesting is that the dollar, the dollar. Oops, let me get that DXY. The dollar is holding quite well. It is down 20 ticks, but that's not the issue. The real issue is. Crude oil is having a sharp move to the downside, down seven points at 102.38. It was at 130.50 just a week ago. This is a big pullback. And you're looking at the TLTR, the bonds, I mean, down 240 at 132.62. In fact, I couldn't even see it. I had to move the letter. I'll be back in a moment for the target condition sale. Hope you can say that.